Hi friends, this is going to be another video talking about the Calibre Gun Cricket. Up to this point, I've received it shooting with the side lever on the right side. If you might have seen my other videos, I shoot left-handed. So this is going to be a quick video showing you what it takes to swap the side lever cocking from the right side of the gun over to the left side. One of the great things about the Calibre Guns, especially the Cricket 2 platform, is just how simple the designs are. So the side plate is held on by four T10 torques. We'll be removing each of these four. And then the only other tool that we're going to need is a 2.5 millimeter Allen, which will be for the screws here and behind the plate. So I have the side plate removed and it will take a little bit of alignment to get the side lever out from that uh, recessed or cut out area here. Not hard, but you do have to angle it just right. And behind here we have one, two, three, two and a half millimeter Allens. I will say that you want to make sure that you've got a good quality Allen key or Allen wrench because for me, that one was extremely tight. You also need to make note that the upper screw is a little bit shorter than the one that's below. So be sure to keep these separated. So here it is with the side lever off. As you can see, it, it had mounted in these two with the upper threaded area being for the shorter screw and the lower threaded area being for the longer screw. And the side lever actually attaching to the threaded hole right there. So I'm gonna remove the side plate from the other side, which is the exact same process. And here it is with both side plates removed. So the next step, I'll go ahead and put the solid one back on the right side. So here we have the other side of the gun. As you can see, this plate's removed. It's ready to be, uh, to have the side lever fastened in. Again, the short screw goes up top. So we've got um, these three 2.5 millimeter Allens and then just refastening the side plate. So there, the side lever is mounted on the other side. We have the two screws back here, one up here, and of course having to turn the, uh, the actual vertical handle from this side down to this side, which is just one more two and a half millimeter. Last step would be to put the side plate back on. So there we go. Now we've got the side lever moved to the opposite side. Um, very simple process, only needed two tools. 2.5 millimeter Allen and a T10. So uh, to other lefties like me out there, we're gonna see what it's like to shoot a gun with a cocking lever on the other side. So be looking out for my next video. Thank you very much.